subscribe and turn on your notifications. When I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hip hop. When I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hip hop. I'm hip hop Harry. We're about to enter another adventure at the hip hop center. This is the place where the fun begins, and you can't have a story without some friends. Is it you? Is it you? I need some more friends for this story. Is it you? Is it you? We'll explore new things, come along and see. So my friends are in place, let the story begin. Ready to learn and have fun, well, come on in. When I say hip-hop, you say Harry. Hip-hop, hip-hop. When I say hip-hop, you say Harry. Hip-hop, hip-hop, it's on! Hey, Pinky, hey, Riddles. Would you guys help me pass out the t-shirts to the orange and green dance teams? Sure. Let's check out these shirts. Ooh, these are cool. <laughs> the backs of the shirts say Hip Hop Central Team. Yeah, the green and orange dance teams are going to love these. But who are the purple ones for? Those are for you and Pinky. We get shirts too? Yup. You and Riddles are judging the dance contest today. And that makes you both part of the Hip Hop Central Team. Cool. Hey, Hip Hop Harry. Hey, Pinky. Hey, Riddles. Hey, hey JJ. JJ. Hey, how's it going? Are we going to start the dance contest now? My team has practiced a lot this weekend. I am so ready to start. I'm glad to see that you're so excited. But before we start the dance contest, I want to give both teams a little more time to practice. And before we practice, it's important that everyone stretches first so your muscles are all warmed up and ready to dance. You're right, Hip Hop Harry. If I want my team to dance their best, we have to make sure that we stretch out really well before we practice. Great! <laughs> Attention dance teams! Pinky and Riddles are gonna pass out t-shirts for each dance team before your final practice for the dance contest. But remember, before you do anything, stretch your bodies. We will! Don't worry, we got it, Hip Hop Harry. <laughs> hey, Sophina, JJ, Elise, and Kylie, your team is the green team. Here are your t-shirts. Thanks. Cool shirts, huh? Yeah, these are really cool. I like green. Go green team! Yeah! Go Green Team! It looks like the Green Team has great team spirit. Let's keep it up while we stretch. Come on, let's stretch over here. Now, reach for the sky. Savannah. Thanks. Scott. Thank you. London. Carly. You guys are the Orange Team. Thanks. Great, let's win, Orange Team. Awesome. Yeah, go Orange Team. Go Orange Team! So let's stretch and get you ready for the dance floor. Get those shirts on. Go, 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 go. Hey there, Orange Team and Green Team. I brought you water to drink while you practice. Thanks, Hip Hop Harry. I was getting sweaty and thirsty from practicing. Water is just what I need. <laughs> You're welcome. Pass them down. <laughs> Do you know why water makes you feel better when you're thirsty and sweaty? No, I don't. Why? Well, your bodies are made up of a lot of different things, but mostly your body is made up of water. Wow, that sounds like a lot of water. I didn't know I had water inside my body. Cool. Yeah, when you exercise, the water in your body comes out in your sweat, and that is why you get thirsty. Whoa. I didn't know that. Uh -huh. When you drink water, you're putting the water that came out of your body when you sweat back inside your body. That's why drinking water makes you feel so good. I didn't know that. <laughs> That's also why you need to drink water before, during, and after you exercise. When you're thirsty, grab a cup. Pour some water and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. When you're thirsty, grab a cup. Pour some water and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. When you need a drink to quench your thirst, water is the drink you should think of first. You can have it in a bottle that's made of plastic. Eight cups a day is really fantastic. Have it room temperature, but have it cold. 
water is the best drink, whether young or old. So when people ask what drink they can offer, don't think twice, just ask for some water. When you're thirsty, grab a cup, pour some water, and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. When you're thirsty, grab a cup, pour some water, and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. When you need a drink to quench your thirst. Water is the drink you should think of first. Water's inside your body and all around the world. It's the perfect drink for all boys and girls. It's not as sweet as juice, but just as nice. When water gets real cold, it turns to ice. Make sure to drink water every day to quench your thirst in a healthy way. When you're thirsty, grab a cup. Pour some water and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. When you're thirsty, grab a cup. Pour some water and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. Ha <laughs> ha. I feel better now. Thanks, Hip Hop Harry. From now on, I'm going to make sure I drink water before, during, and after I exercise. Good. Everyone make sure that you drink some water before we start the dance contest. Thanks, Hip Hop Harry. Yeah. Go. Hey, Savannah, why aren't you practicing? Oh, hi, Hip Hop Harry. I'm just getting some more water for my team before we start the dance contest. That's nice of you, Savannah. Hey, are you okay? You don't seem very excited about the dance contest. Well, Hip Hop Harry, I am excited, and I want my orange team to win, but my sister, Sophina, is on the green team, and I don't want her to feel bad if her team loses. It's nice that you're worried about your sister's feelings, Savannah, but there's nothing wrong with working hard and wanting to win the dance contest, even if Sophine is on the other team. Really? Yeah. In fact, it's natural to want to win because it means that you're going to give it your very best and you believe in yourself and your team. I do believe in myself and my team. <laughs> Hi, sis. Hi, Hip Hop Harry. Hi, Hi Sophina. Sophina. I sure am thirsty. My team has been working up a sweat practicing. Whew, I can't wait to start. <laughs> We're going to start very soon. Awesome. I'm so excited to dance with my team. Aren't you, Savannah? Yeah, I'm excited. What's wrong, Savannah? You don't sound excited. Well, Sophina, I want to win, but I'll feel bad if your team loses. Oh, that's OK, Savannah. I want my team to win, too. But I'll be happy for you if your team wins. All that matters is that we do our best, no matter what happens. You're my sister, and we're friends whether I win or you win. Really? Yeah! Teams, are you ready to dance? Yeah! <laughs> All right, guys, let's see your best moves. Is everyone ready to cheer for the dance teams? Go orange! Go, go green! Yeah! Go orange! Go green! Yeah! Great! Pinky and Riddles are going to be the judges of the dance contest. And remember, everyone here is a winner. Do your best. 
have fun, and let's see some cool moves! Whoa! That was really amazing! Good job, Orange Team! Now, it's time for the Green Team! Let's give our judges some time to decide who won. Wow, that orange team was great. That move they did was incredible. That was great. When the green team came together for that one move, it was awesome. Too bad we have to choose one winner. I know. Who's it gonna be? All right, everyone. We're ready to announce the winners of the dance contest. Both orange and green team were so great today. It was really hard to choose just one winner. Green team, you are the winners! Yeah! 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 That's right, Good green job. team, you win. Your flips were so amazing. And orange team, your dance was really cool too. Job. Great yes. job as well. <laughs> Everyone here is on Team Hip Hop Central, so we're all part of the winning team. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Way to go, Sophina. Your green team was great, and the flip you did was awesome. Thanks, Savannah. I'm so proud of you. Your dance was amazing. Thanks. I'm proud of you, too. Do you think next time we can dance on the same team? I love that. When you win, I win. And when I win, you win. There's nothing better than a great day at Hip Hop Central. And I want you all to know that you make me so proud. Do you know why? I love to learn. I love 
A lot of dancing. We also learned a lot today. We sure did. Haha. <laughs> What did we learn today? Yes, Scott. I learned why drinking water makes me feel better when I'm thirsty and sweaty. Let's take a look. When you exercise, the water in your body comes out in your sweat, and that is why you get thirsty. Whoa! I didn't know that. Uh -huh. When you drink water, you're putting the water that came out of your body when you sweat back inside your body. That's why drinking water makes you feel so good. <laughs> That's also why you need to drink water before, during, and after you exercise. When you're thirsty, grab a cup, pour some water, and drink it up. Say cold, cold water. Say cold, cold water. That was a lot of fun. I was thirsty after the dance contest, so I drank some water. It was just what I needed. Great! Just like we need to exercise to feel good, we need to drink water to feel good too. Did we learn anything else today? Yes, Savannah. What did you learn? I learned that it's okay to want to win, even if my sister's on the other team. Let's check it out. Well, Hip Hop Harry, I am excited, and I want my orange team to win. But my sister Sophina is on the green team. And I don't want her to feel bad if her team loses. It's nice that you're worried about your sister's feelings, Savannah. But there's nothing wrong with working hard and wanting to win the dance contest, even if Sophie is on the other team. Really? Yeah. In fact, it's natural to want to win because it means that you're going to give it your very best and you believe in yourself and your team. Yeah, <laughs> that was great. I know. If I do my best, my sister will always be rooting for me. I sure will. <laughs> That's right. Family is always on the same team. Whoa! We sure did learn a lot today. You know what else we did a lot of today? Dancing! <laughs> That's right. And you can never dance too much. So it's time for the Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle. <laughs> When I say dance, you say circle dance. Circle dance. Circle. All right. But before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up. That's right. And I have a warm up dance for us to do. All right, okay. I want to teach y'all a warm up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go. Jump to the left. Jump to the right. Throw your hands up. Now put them at your side. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Jump. <laughs> yeah! 
Now that we've warmed up, it's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! That's right! Let's do it! Everyone. Hey, I'm Hey, Bob Perry. Perry. What are you all up to? We're just thinking about what we want to do today. And what did you all come up with? Well, there's so many things to do. We can dance, or we can rap, or we can play a game. Hold it right there. What if there was something that uses all three things? You could dance, rap, and play a game all at once. Really? Cool. Awesome! So what's the game called? It's something I created called the Make a Dance Game. Make a Dance Game! That sounds like fun! Can we play now? We sure can! Yeah! Yeah! Come on everybody, the wait is up! Drop it low, now raise it up! Let's play a game where you say your name, then you game a dance and you make it up! dances that everyone made up are great. Using your imagination could be fun, huh? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Now, I want you all to use your imagination to think of another fun activity you can do. Sure, no problem. Okay. okay. I can't wait to see what you all come up with. <laughs> yeah. When I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hip hop, come inside. Hey, Hip Hop Harry. Hi. Hey, kids. Did you use your imagination to come up with something fun to do? Yes. We decided on an art project. That's right. We want to cut out different fruit trees and make a collage of them. That's a great idea. Thanks, Hip Hop Harry. But we don't know what kind of fruits grow on trees. Well, let's take a look in the Hip Hop Harry fruit bowl. Yeah, let's do come it. On. What are we waiting for? 
We can see if there are any fruits in there that come from trees. Do grapes come from trees? Why don't we go to the fun fact screen and find out? Savannah, grab the fruit bowl and follow me. Come on, this is gonna be so cool. You are all gonna be so surprised to find out what fruits actually grow on trees. <laughs> Let's take a look. You see, grapes don't grow on a tree. They're a kind of fruit that grows on a vine. How about these strawberries? Do strawberries grow on trees? <laughs> no, strawberries grow from a small plant, not a tree. I think I found a fruit that grows on a tree. How about an orange? <laughs> Bingo! An orange is a fruit that grows on a tree. Did you know an orange is filled with vitamin C, which keeps you healthy? Really? I love oranges. They taste great. <laughs> I guess having vitamin C in it is an added bonus. Thanks for your help, Hip Hop Harry. Now we can start a fruit tree collage with an orange tree. Do you have everything you need to make a collage? We sure do. We're using colored paper, safety scissors, and glue to make different cutouts of fruit trees. Sounds like that fruit is going to look good enough to pick right off the tree. I can't wait to see it when you're done. When I say hip hop, you say Harry. Hip hop, hip hop. Hey, hip hop Harry. Hey, hip hop Harry. Hey, Kiana. Good to see you, Norma. What's up? Today is a big day for me. My double dutch team will be competing for the championship. Wow, good luck. Thanks. Hip Hop Harry, we have about an hour before the competition starts. Is it okay if my team practices outside on the playground before we go? Sure. If you practice hard, I'm sure you'll do great. You know what I always say, practice, practice makes, makes perfect. perfect. Thanks. <laughs> I'll be back soon. Bye, Hip Hop Harry. See you later, Kiana. Uh, Goodbye. Hey, what's wrong, Kiana? My sister is one of my best friends, but she doesn't have time for me anymore. What do you mean? All she thinks about is getting ready for her double dutch competition. Well, she's obviously excited about her competition. But you know you're very important to her, right? Well, she doesn't act like I'm important to her anymore. If you want to spend more time with your sister, start by showing interest in what she likes to do. What do you mean? Why don't you try and get involved with her double dutch competition? How? She already has her double dutch teammates. She doesn't need me. If you think about it, I know you'll come up with a way to get involved with Norma's life that'll make both of you happy. Are you sure, Hip Hop Harry? Why don't you give it a try? You know, that's a good idea. Hip Hop Harry, can we have another bottle of glue? I'll be right over. Okay, thank you. One sec. Why don't you give them this bottle of glue and ask them if you can help out? They don't look like they need me. You won't know unless you ask. This is just the kind of thing you might want to do with your sister and her double dutch team. Okay, I'll try. There you go. Here's the glue. Hey, would you guys like me to help out? Sure. Yeah. You can help us make our next fruit tree. Sure. <laughs> when I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Look, hip hop Harry, we made another fruit tree. Wow, this looks great. Do you know what kind of fruit tree this is? Well, the fruit is kind of round and brown. Let's take a look in the hip hop Harry fruit bowl. All right. Hmm. I see something that's brown and round. A kiwi! Yeah, yeah we got, got it! it. <laughs> Do you want to see something cool? Yeah! Definitely! Then follow me to the kitchen. All right. Now the kiwi may be brown on the outside. <laughs> but it's green on the inside. Wow! Yeah, not only does the kiwi taste great, but it is also filled with vitamin C, just like an orange. Go ahead, taste it. Mmm, yummy! That's amazing! It's good. Hip Hop Harry, you know the kiwi tree was Kiana's idea. Yeah, see Kiana? Great things can happen when you get involved. 
If you feel left out, get involved. Take the first step in. Get involved. Don't hesitate. Participate in. Get involved. Come on. Get involved. Getting involved is a great way to find new things to fascinate you. From sports, clubs, and even conversation. There's always something to participate in. When you find interest in any task and you want to try, don't be afraid to ask. As life goes on and the world revolves, the best times come from getting involved. If you feel left out, get involved. Take the first step in. Get involved. Don't hesitate. Participate in. Get involved. Come on. Get involved. Whether with friends, family, or by yourself, to get involved is to apply yourself. And that itself is positive to do kids to get involved is to be included you can help in the kitchen to make a tasty lunch just don't get involved with the lazy bunch as life goes on and the world revolves the best times come from getting involved if you feel left out get involved take the first step in get involved don't hesitate participate in get involved come on get involved Hip-Hop Harry, I get it. If I become interested in the things my sister is excited about, we can spend lots of time together. That's 100% correct. Hey, everyone. Hey, hey, hey Mama. Mama. May I refill my water bottle? Absolutely. Thanks. Now's your chance, Kiana. Go ask her. How is your double dutch practice going? It's going pretty well. Thanks for asking. Norma, I love to watch you practice. That's great. Is there something I can do to help out? I'm sure there is. Even if there isn't, I would just love to have you there. Really? Of course. I love having you around. Cool. I have an idea. Hey, Pop Harry, is it okay if Norma and her team finish their practice in here? I'm sure everyone would love to see their double dash routine. Sure. Cool. I'll go get the team. That's a great idea, Kiana. Thanks. Ha <laughs> yeah, zoom. When I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hip hop. Today we have a special treat, and I think Kiana would like to do the introductions. I sure would. My sister, who's also one of my best friends, is part of a team called the Double Dutch Dazzlers. They have a big competition today, but before they go, they're going to rehearse their routine. One last time, just for us. Go Dazzlers! 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 differently? Well, the flip you do in the beginning is so amazing. I think you should save it until the end. Great yeah. idea. That's a great idea. Thanks, sis. Well, we've got to go. Our competition starts soon. Good luck. See you soon. What do you mean, see you soon? Don't you want to come with us? Do you want me to come? Of course I want you to go. I just didn't think you're interested. You know, it wouldn't be the same without having my little sister there. Really? I'm going to my sister's competition. Wish us good luck. Good, good luck. luck. Go Dazzlers. Go, go Dazzlers. Dazzlers. Go Dazzlers. Go Dazzlers. Yay. Wow. That was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Hey, Hip Hop Harry. We made another fruit treat. Can you tell what kind of tree this is? Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's an apple tree. You got, got it. it! Yeah! Wow! You guys really did a great job making this collage. Thanks, Hip Hop Harry. It was fun figuring out which fruits grow on trees. Like an orange tree, a kiwi tree, and an apple tree. Yeah! See, I knew you guys could figure out something fun to do today. You just had to use your imaginations. Exactly! Yeah! Don't forget, Kiana helped too. 
She came up with the idea for the kiwi tree. You're right. Hey, Bob Harry, have you heard anything from Kiana or the Double Dutch Dazzlers? Yeah. Do you know if they won? I haven't heard anything yet, but even if they don't win, they should be proud because they practiced hard and gave it their best. We're, We're number one. one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. and everyone here at Hip Hop Central for supporting us. I also want to give a special thanks to my little sister, Kiana. Thanks for getting involved and taking an interest. I'm glad you included me. Thank you, big sis. I bet it feels good to win the championship. I'm happy that it helped our relationship. And the greatest gift you can give each other is to show support and teach one another. And I want you all to know that you make me so proud. Do you know why? Yeah, because I love to learn. That's right. I love to learn. I love to learn. I love to learn. I love to learn. I had a question. It needed an answer. I asked my friends there. has been a fun-filled day. So, what did we learn? Kiana. My sister was so busy getting ready for her double dutch competition that I didn't think she had time to spend with me. And that made me sad. Well, what did you learn? I learned that if you want to spend more time with someone, you can make it happen by taking an interest in what they do, by getting involved. Let's take a look. If you feel left out, get involved. Take the first step in. Get involved. How is your double dutch practice going? It's going pretty well. Thanks for asking. Norma, I love to watch you practice. That's great. Is there something I can do to help out? I'm sure there is. Even if there isn't, I would just love to have you there. Really? Of course. I love having you around. Cool. Getting involved with my sister's life not only made me happy, but it made her happy too. And getting involved helped her win the double dutch competition. That has to make you feel great. It sure does. Yeah. So, what else did we learn today? Yes, Savannah? I learned that when you're bored and you're looking for something to do, all you have to do is use your imagination to come up with an activity like make a dance game. wait to make up some more dances. Me too. Hey, how about this new dance? The bunny hop. Do the bunny hop. Do, do the, the bunny, bunny hop. hop. Do, do the, the bunny hop. hop. Do, do the, the bunny hop. hop. Yeah. <laughs> Anybody else? JJ. I learned about fruits that grow on trees. Let's take a look. 
You guys really did a great job making this collage. Thanks, Hip Hop Perry. It was fun figuring out which fruits grow on trees, like an orange tree, a kiwi tree, and an apple tree. Yeah, see, I knew you guys could figure out something fun to do today. You just had to use your imaginations. Exactly. Yeah. I love the way oranges, kiwis, and apples taste. And now I know that they're all fruits that grow on trees. Yeah. Remember, oranges and kiwis give you a daily dose of vitamin C, which is an important addition to your daily dose of exercise. And what's my favorite kind of exercise? Dancing! That's right. It's time for the... Hip Hop Perry Dance Circle! When I say dance, you say circle, dance. Circle! Dance! Circle! All right. But before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up! That's right. And I have a warm-up dance for us to do. All right, okay. I want to teach y'all a warm-up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go! Jump to the left. Jump to the right. Throw your hands up. Now put them at your side. Do the Harry. 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 Somebody scream! Yeah! All right! Now that we've warmed up, it's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! That's right! Let's do it! for a minute. What's up? Hey, Hip Hop Harry, what's happening? What's going on? <laughs> Would you guys like to help me with a special project? Sure. Absolutely. What are we gonna do, Hip Hop Harry? Well, I was hoping you could help me make some hand puppets, and then we could put on a puppet show later for the other kids. Cool, I made a hand puppet once with a paper bag. Haha, <laughs> paper bags do make great hand puppets, but today we're gonna use socks. Cool, socks. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all these cool things I have that can be used for the eyes, ears, hair, or whatever you want. Just be creative and you can make some great sock puppets. That's awesome, Hip Hop Harry. Mm, I don't know. What's wrong, JJ? Don't you want to make a hand puppet? No, thank you, Hip Hop Harry. I'll just watch. I've never made a hand puppet before. Well, there's a first time for everything. I don't know, Hip Hop Harry. What if my puppet doesn't look good? <laughs> JJ, everyone's puppet will be good in its own way. What do you mean? Well, puppets are like people. No two are the same. Just because Elizabeth is different from Ryan, and Ryan is different from you, that doesn't mean any of you are less special than the other. Just like you guys, all of your hand puppets will be special. I don't know, Hip Hop Harry. I might mess it up. I think you'll make a great sock puppet. Yeah, don't worry, we'll help you out. Yeah. See, JJ, Elizabeth, Veronica, and Ryan are willing to help. So just give it a try. You might be surprised by what you can do. I'll help you pick out something for your eyes. Thank you, Veronica. I will give it a try. Cool. Now give me a high five. Bam. <laughs> when I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hey, everybody! Oh, hey, 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 hey. Yeah. hey, what are you guys doing? We're making hand puppets for our puppet show. Wow, that sounds like fun! It is. Would you like to join us? I'd love to. But first, I brought some fruits and vegetables for all of you to snack on. Come on, let's go to the kitchen and check it out. I'll meet you over there in a minute. 
I'm gonna go check on the other kids. Okay, oh, sure. sure. Hey. Oh, I love fruit. Strawberries are my favorite. I love vegetables. Me too. I eat fruits and vegetables every day. It's a great way to stay healthy. Here, try some. Mmm. Mm. This carrot tastes good. <laughs> May I have one? I like carrots too. You're right, JJ. This carrot tastes good. And it's fun to crunch. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Pinky. Yeah, thanks, Pinky. You're welcome, kids. Enjoy it. I'll be right back. Look, I have two tomato slices. You like tomatoes? I don't like them. I love them. Tomatoes are delicious fruit. Tomatoes aren't fruit. They're a vegetable. You know, lots of people think that. But tomatoes are fruits because they have seeds. Take a look. The seeds make them a fruit. What's going on, kids? Hey, Hip Hop Harry. I said that tomatoes are a fruit because they have seeds. But Ryan said they are a vegetable. Who's right? Actually, you're right, Elizabeth. Tomatoes are fruits. Yeah. Are you sure? Because if that's true, then that means a cucumber is a fruit because it has seeds. You're right, Ryan. Cucumbers do have seeds, so they are fruits too. So, what are vegetables? Vegetables are sometimes leafy, but they never have seeds. Like celery. Right again, Elizabeth. Celery is a vegetable because it's leafy and it doesn't have seeds, just like cauliflower and spinach. Wait a minute. Bananas are a fruit, right? They sure are. But they don't have seeds. They sure do. Look at that banana for yourself. You see all the small black dots? Oh, I see, right in the middle. That's right, those are seeds. This is so cool. Ha <laughs> ha, fruits and vegetables, vegetables and fruits. Doesn't matter what you call them, they're all good for you. So I went to the store. The shopkeeper asked, what did I come in for? I wanted a snack, a vegetable, or a fruit. She gave me a tomato and asked, what this fruit do? I said, this is a fruit. How can that be? She said, tomatoes are fruits because they have seeds. Just like bell peppers and kiwis. They're all fruits because they all have seeds. An apple is a fruit. It has seeds. Lettuce is a veggie. It's leafy green. To know if it's a fruit. Check the seeds. Veggies are good for me. Yes, I was so surprised, couldn't believe my eyes. Vegetable, I see the leafy green. Just like spinach and cauliflower, they're all on the same team. So many fruits and veggies here. Now for me to choose. Fruit, leaf, or root, you see, they're all very good for you. An apple is a fruit. It has seeds. Lettuce is a veggie. It's leafy green. To know if it's a fruit. to check for seeds to see if it's a fruit or a vegetable. Thanks, Hip Hop Perry. Sure, anytime, Ryan. Hey, I have an idea. What is it, Elizabeth? Why don't we make our puppets look like fruits and vegetables so that we can talk about them in our puppet show? Well, that sounds Let's like yeah. awesome. You know what else we need? Every show needs a host. My puppet can be the host of our show. That's great. I'll get the stage ready with the other kids while you guys finish your hand puppets. Cool, I can't wait. Yeah. 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 When I say hip hop, you say Harry. Hip hop, hip hop, puppets on. Hey, kids. Oh, hey, 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 hey. What's up? Oh, wow, your puppets look great. Thanks. 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 So, did you enjoy all your fruits and vegetables? Oh, oh sure. Yeah, they are so good. And Hip Hop Harry taught us the difference between fruits and vegetables. Fruits have seeds, and vegetables don't. That's right. You guys are quick learners. 
We made our hand puppets look like fruits and vegetables so that we can talk about them in our puppet show. That's great, Elizabeth. Hey, what do you have there, JJ? I made Mr. Mouth. <laughs> <laughs> At first, I was afraid to make a hand puppet because I never made one before, but Hip Hop Harry told me to just give it a try. So I did. Well, way to go, JJ. Wow! You kids did a wonderful job! Great work! Thanks, Thanks Hip-Hop Harry. Harry! Look at Mr. Mouth, Hip-Hop Harry! JJ, you did a great job! And I really like what you did with the hat! You do? Yup, I sure do! Thanks, Hip-Hop Harry! <laughs> <laughs> and you were right! Even though it might seem scary at first, trying new things can be a lot of fun! See? I told you amazing things can happen when you just give it a try. The whole world is full of new things to try. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't. Just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never, never give up. up. Just give, give it, it a try. try. When everybody's talking about something new, like playing a game or a type of food, don't say I can't or I don't like it or I don't know until you've tried it. There's a whole world of new things to try, from playing a new sport to a slice of pie. So if there's a new thing that needs exploring, don't quit. Give it a try. Try and go for it. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't. Just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never, never give up. up. Just give, give it, it a try. try. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't. Just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never, never give, give up. up. Just give, give it a try. try. When you try new things, you can make new friends. It helps you learn and build experience. You never know. You just might love it. You might end up making the best sock puppet. Don't be afraid, don't quit or cry. When you hear a new thing, just give it a try. You might find a hobby, don't be surprised. When you hear a new thing, just give it a try. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't, just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never give up, just give it a try. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't. Just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never give up. Just give it a try. Today we have a special puppet show for you. So sit back, relax, and enjoy Mr. Mouse, Veggie Victor, and Fruity Frida! Right. Hi, Mr. Mouse. Have you had anything to eat today? Yeah, I've had candy, chips, and soda. Oh no, those things are not good for you. They don't have the vitamins and minerals your body needs to go big and strong. Well, what kinds of foods do have vitamins and minerals? Fresh fruits like me. And vegetables like me. Have you ever tried eating fruits or vegetables, Mr. Mouse? No, I haven't. Well, now's a good time to start. But what if I don't like them? Well, Mr. Mouse, you won't know if you like them or not unless you give them a try. I guess you're right, Fruity Frida. But what kinds of fruits and vegetables should I try? Vegetables like these. Broccoli, spinach, and asparagus. Wow, these vegetables look good, Veggie Victor. Or you could try fruits like the ones over here. Strawberries, pears, and avocados. Wait a minute, avocados are fruits? Yes, because each avocado has a seed. But that would mean tomatoes and cucumbers are fruits too, because they have seeds. That's right. Tomatoes and cucumbers are fruits, too. Wow, I just learned something new. <laughs> so when should I eat fruits and vegetables? Every, Every day. day. Every day? Cool, I can't wait to start eating fruits and vegetables so I can be big and strong. That's great, Mr. Man. Yeah.
Thank you, Fruity Frida and Veggie Victor. Anytime. Sure. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Let's give a round of applause for Mr. Mouth, Veggie Victor, and Fruity Frida. That's it. Well, I hope you enjoyed our show. That was so awesome. Whoa, those puppets are amazing. <laughs> Great job with the puppet show, guys. Hey, everybody, let's have another round of applause for Veronica as host Holly. Elizabeth as Fruity Frida. Ryan as Veggie Victor. And JJ as Mr. Mal. The show was fantastic. I'm glad I came by today. <laughs> well, we're glad you brought by all those healthy fruits and vegetables. They were good. They were yes. good. They were Tasty. great. It was my pleasure. Just remember to eat your fruits and vegetables every day because they're full of vitamins and minerals that help keep your body big and strong. Okay? Okay! Yeah! Go! 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 It makes me so happy when I get to spend time with you guys at Hip Hop Central. And I want you all to know that you make me so proud. Do you know why? Yeah! Because I love to learn! That's right! I love to learn! I love to learn! I love to learn! I love to learn! I had a question, it needed an answer. I asked my friends, they're hip-hop dancers. Where could I go? Where should I look to start our adventure? They gave me a book. I opened it up and to my surprise, many fun things were hidden inside. I could learn about places far and near or learn about what I want to do for my career. It's so much fun. Just try and see. There's so many things that you can learn in the library. Did you have fun today? Yeah! Cool! So did I. And I learned a lot, too. Did you learn anything today? JJ. I learned that even if you're afraid to do something new, you should still give it a try, because something good can come of it. Let's take a look. I made Mr. Mouth. <laughs> At first, I was afraid to make a hand puppet, because I never made one before. But Hip Hop Harry told me to just give it a try. So I did. Don't let a good thing pass you by. Never say I can't. Just give it a try. When things are new or difficult at times, never, never give up. up. Just give it a try. Cool. I'm ready to try all sorts of new things now. You see, JJ, you were afraid to try something new, but you did it anyway. And look at what you made. Yeah, Mr. Mouth is pretty cool, huh? He sure is, JJ, just like you. So, what else did we learn today? Elizabeth. I learned that we can put on a great puppet show. Yeah! yeah. Let's check it out. It was a lot of fun. That was a great puppet show, everyone. Yeah! That's right. Great work, kids. Who else learned something new today? Ryan. I learned the difference between fruits and vegetables. Well, let's take a look. What's going on, kids? Hey, Hip Hop Harry. I said that tomatoes are a fruit because they have seeds. But Ryan said they are a vegetable. Who's right? Actually, you're right, Elizabeth. Tomatoes are fruits. An apple is a fruit. It has seeds. Lettuce is a veggie. It's leafy green. To know if it's a fruit. Check the seeds. Veggies are good for me. Yes, so now I know if it has seeds, it's a fruit. And if it doesn't, it's a vegetable. Well, kids, we certainly learned a lot today. Learning and trying new things are very important. Our brains got a lot of exercise. But do you know my favorite type of exercise? Dancing! That's 
That's right. It's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle. When I say dance, you say circle. Dance. Circle. Dance. Circle. All right. But before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up. That's right, and I have a warm-up dance for us to do. All right, okay. I want to teach y'all a warm-up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go. Jump to the left. Jump to the right. Throw your hands up. Now put them at your side. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Jump to the left. Jump to the right. Throw your hands up. Now put them do the hair, do the hair, do the hair, do the hair. Somebody scream! Yeah! All right. Now that we've warmed up, it's time for the hip hop Harry dance circle. That's right. Let's do it. you all to have a seat right over here. Okay. I have a surprise for you guys today. Awesome! Now this is a big surprise. The circus is coming to Hip Hop Central. The circus is coming! The circus is coming! Yeah. Have any of you ever been to the circus? Oh, I have. I love the circus. Yeah, me too. I haven't. What happens at the circus? Lots of really fun stuff. There are the animal trainers that train all kinds of animals to do tricks, like the lion tamers that train big lions. That's so cool. There are other people who walk on a wire high above the audience. Whoa, that's right. And they only have a net to catch them if they fall. I almost forgot. They're also clowns. They're so funny. <laughs> My favorite part of the circus is the strong man. He can lift the car with his hands. And his muscles are really big. <laughs> All right. Let's get this place ready for our circus. Yeah! Come on, guys. Help me move this. Yeah. Oh, hey, guys. Hey, hey William. William. How's your foot? It's OK, but tomorrow will be much better. I get to go to the doctor, and finally he can take this thing off my foot. So what's going on around here? The circus is coming to Hip Hop Central today. That's really cool. We're just getting everything ready. Do you want to help? I don't know. I can't move around like I usually do. The doctor told me to take it easy. I wish the circus was coming tomorrow instead. You sound kind of down, William. Well, I just feel left out. I want to help get everything ready for the circus, but I don't know what to do with this thing on my foot. Just because you have a soft boot on your foot doesn't mean you can't help out or do anything. Hmm, you think so? Cheer up, don't frown about. You may be down, but you're not out. You can always participate, there's no doubt. Just use your very own special route, so... Cheer up, don't frown about. You may be down, but you're not out. You can always participate, there's no doubt. Just use your very own special route. 
You may be down, but it's not the end. You can still find ways to have fun with your friends. If you hurt your leg and you can't run, cheer your friends along. It's really fun. If you're feeling sick and can't dance today, you can still enjoy all the music that's played. So don't give up or show any doubt. You may be down, but you're not out. So cheer up. Don't frown or pout. You may be down, but you're not out. You can always participate. There's no doubt. Just use your very own special route. So cheer up. You're right, guys. Just because I have this boot on doesn't mean I can't help out and have fun. Come on, we have a circus coming. We have to make sure everything's ready. That's right, William. Dante should be here any minute. He's bringing the circus to Hip Hop Central, and we want to make him feel welcome. Well, hey, I know what I can do. Maybe I can make a sign that says, Welcome, Dante. Ha <laughs> ha, that would be great. I know he'll really like that. Yeah, and I can make it really big and use lots of different colors. See, William, even with your boot on, you'll figure a way to help out and have fun at the same time. Okay, guys, let's get this place ready. Yes! Go, 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 go! That looks great, guys. <laughs> Whoa, that sounds like Dante. I'll go check. It's Dante! Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. Look at him go! Yeah. He's only on yeah. one wheel! Oh, I'm a fuck! What are you trying to say, Dante? I'm a fuck! Whoa! <laughs> wow! Oh. <laughs> wow! I was trying to say sorry I'm late, but I lost the other wheel to my bicycle, so it took me a bit longer to get here. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, nice sign. Thanks. Oh, we just wanted to make you feel welcome. Well, I do feel welcome. And the circus is about to begin. Oh, yeah! yeah! You take this. Wow, thanks. You take this. Neat. You take this. Cool. And you, you take this. Awesome. Now, hmm, where am I going to put yeah. this? Thing? I have an idea. I have the perfect place for this. Oh, neat. That's amazing. Uh, what else do you have? Hey, Hip Hop Harry, can you grab me that really big ball over there? Sure thing, Dante. Here you go. Boom. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> now each of you throw your ball up one at a time. Ready? One, two, and three! Wow. Ooh, quite a view from up here. Yes, sir, Hip Hop Central is the perfect place for the circus. Where are the other people who are in the circus? Hey, Hip Hop Harry, should we tell them? I think so. You, you are, are the, the circus. circus! Us? That's right, all of you. But how can we be the circus? Yeah, we don't know anything about being in a circus. That's okay. Everything we need for the circus is right here in this bag. And with a little help from all of you, we're gonna have a great circus. Are you guys in? Yeah! When I say hip hop, you say Harry. Hip hop, hip hop, put it on. Wow. Let's start with you. What do you wanna do for the circus? I wanna be a lion tamer. Wow, you must be really brave. Do you know what lion tamers do? I do. Lion tamers train lions to do all sorts of tricks, like jumping up on stools. Good thing we don't have a real lion. That's something only professionals can do. I know. But how can I be a lion tamer without a lion? We can pretend. Yeah! But how? I have just the thing. No way, I wonder what it is. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. wow. How fast yeah. you it. Wow. That's incredible. Whoa! Wow. That's great. It looks like a real lion. Yeah. Amazing. Thanks, Dante. That's incredible. It sure yeah. is. Yes. Nice. I want to be a clown. I love clowns. 
All you need is this. What is it? Wow! Whoa! Whoa! Amazing! Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Whoa! Here you go. But something's still missing. I know what it is. Something's missing? I wonder what that could be. Whoa! Perfect. This is cool, but I'm not sure if I can make people laugh. Sure you can. You can make funny faces. <laughs> Every clown has a funny walk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. yeah. What about you? What would you like to do? I want to be the strong man. Well, the most important thing a strong man does is lift a thousand pounds. A thousand pounds? That's a lot. How can I do that? I think you're going to need some more muscles. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. This one's going to be cool. Whoa. Wow. Look at those muscles. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're almost as big as mine. <laughs> <laughs> look at the strong man. Yeah, Tyler. <laughs> you look strong. These are great, but what am I going to lift? Let me show you. Whoa! Whoa! Wow. What is he gonna do now? I don't know. Whoa! Wow. Look how great. heavy that is. So Five hundred pounds. pounds. That's way too heavy. I think you're the only one who could lift it. But don't lift it now. Save it for later. No problem. Wow, this circus is really coming together. But you're missing the person who runs the whole show. Do you guys know who I'm talking about? The ringmaster! That's right! I think that William should be the ringmaster. R really? O okay. Great, William's gonna be the ringmaster. Yeah. The most important thing a ringmaster does is announce all the performers. But before you could be a ringmaster, you're gonna need a hat. See, the ringmaster has the biggest hat in the entire circus. Wow. Wow. Whoa. Watch this. Wow. He's about to make a hat right now. Wow. wow. This is cool. This is great. But now, I need something that will get everyone's attention. How about this? Hmm. Whoa. Wow. wow. This will work just great, Dante. Ha <laughs> ha, perfect. You see, William, all you need is a little imagination and you can help out and have fun even when you can't move like everyone else. You're right, Hip Hop Perry. This is gonna be the best Big Top Circus ever! Most awesome show on earth is in town. It's Hip Hop Aries Big Top. Hip Hop Aries Big Top. Hey everybody, gather round. The most awesome show on earth is in town. When I say hip hop, you say Big Top. Hip Hop. Big Top. Hip Hop. Big top. Step right up and watch the show. Under the Big Top is where we go. The circus is sure to bring lots of fun that can be enjoyed by everyone. When the lion roared, what a scary game. As a tamer, I have to be brave. I'm trained to tame. Most awesome show on earth is in town. It's hip hop, Harry's big top. Hip hop, Harry's big top. Hey everybody, gather round. The most awesome show on earth is in town. When I say hip hop, you say big top. Hip hop, big top. Hip hop, big top. Look at my mouth, look big and strong. Mighty mighty me is the name of my song. As a strong man, I pose and flex in the circuit. Hey, who's next? It's me, the funny lady. I'm a clown. I make people laugh from town to town with my silly game and my silly suit. Most awesome show on earth is in town. It's hip hop, Harry's big top. Hip hop, Harry's big top. Hey, everybody, gather round. The most awesome show on earth is in town. When I say hip hop, you say big top. Hip hop, big top. Hip hop. Big top. When I say hip hop, you say big top. Hip hop.
Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the Hip Hop Central Circus! Yeah! And now, please welcome your ringmaster, William! Yeah! Hello, everybody, and thank you, Hip Hop Harry. Now, today, at the Hip Hop Central Kids Circus, you will see acts that will surprise and amaze you. But now, for our first act, you will see the strong man, and he is going to lift a thousand pounds. Please welcome t -t 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 Tyler! Yeah! Yeah! Whoa. <laughs> oh. Impressive. But now, oh, oh, what is this I see? It's Kiana the Clown. <laughs> and she's walking her dog. Whoa. Looks to me like your dog doesn't want to walk. <laughs> that dog sure is stubborn. <laughs> oh, see you later, Kiana. Oh! Everybody, let's hear it for Kiana. Yeah! Thank you. And now, for another performer with an animal, Please welcome your lion tamer, Kendra! Yeah! Now watch as she gets her lion to jump up on this stool. Okay, ready? Up, up, good boy. Yeah! <laughs> wow, Kendra, good job. Let's hear it for Kendra, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. That was your hip hop sensual Kids Circus! Yeah! yeah! All of you did a great job! Hey, William, I bet you didn't know that those balloons on your head are magic balloons. <laughs> These balloons? That's right. See, all I have to do is snap my fingers and... Whoa! Yeah, that's amazing! Oh, Thanks, Dante. You guys are the best. I can't wait to come back. Please, Please come back, come back Please. Please. Yeah, come back. come back, Dante. Go, 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 go. We had tons of fun today at Hip Hop Central, and I want you all to know that you make me so proud. And do you know why? Yeah, because I love to learn. That's right. something they learned. Yes, Kendra? I learned about all the things that happen at the circus. Let's take a look. There are the animal trainers that train all kinds of animals to do tricks, like the lion tamers that train big lions. That's so cool. When the lion roared, what a scary game. As a tamer, I have to be brave. I'm trained to tame the scary Leo. At the circus, I am a hero. That was a lot of fun! I can't wait until a circus with real lion tamers comes to town. Me that would be fun! Yeah, that would be fun! <laughs> yes, Kiana? I learned that if you can't actually go to a circus, you can put one on by just using your imagination. Let's check it out! You, you are, are the, the circus. circus! Us? That's right! But how can we be the circus? Yeah, we don't know anything about being in a circus. That's okay. Everything we need for the circus is right here in this bag. 
And with a little help from all of you, we're gonna have a great circus. Are you guys in? Yes! That was the best circus I've ever been to. Maybe Dante can come back soon and we can put on another circus. That's a great idea, Kiana. Now, did anybody else learn anything? Yes, William. I learned that even when you're down, you're not out. You can always find ways to participate. Cool, let's see. Maybe I can make a sign that says, welcome Dante. See, William, even with your boot on, you'll figure a way to help out and have fun at the same time. Cheer up, don't frown or doubt. You may be down, but sure not out. You can always participate, there's no doubt. Just use your very own special route. I'm glad I didn't let this boot stop me from having some fun. <laughs> now, everyone did such a great job today. We exercised our imaginations, but now it's time to exercise our bodies. And what's my favorite exercise? Dancing! That's right. It's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! When I say dance, you say circle. Dance! Circle! Dance! Circle! Yeah, but before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up! That's right, and I have a warm up dance for us to do. All right, okay. I want to teach y'all a warm up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go! Jump to the left, jump to the right. Throw your hands up, now put them at your side. Do the Harry. <laughs> All right, now that we've warmed up, it's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! That's right, let's do it! Dancers. I love dancing. Katie, you are a terrific ballet dancer. Thanks. I've been dancing ballet my whole life, and I love it, but I wish I knew some hip-hop moves like everyone else. Well, you can always learn. Do you really think so? That would be so cool. Sure. You already know how to dance. Yeah, I know how to ballet dance. Right. It takes a lot of skill and practice to dance ballet. If you can do that, then I'm sure you can learn a few hip-hop moves in no time. Really? That would be so cool. Yeah. Bam. Hey, everyone. Gather round. Yeah. Davide, how did you learn to do all those cool hip-hop dance moves I just saw? I go to hip-hop dance classes a couple of times a week. Wow! Do all of you take hip-hop dance classes? Oh, yeah! I've never taken a hip-hop dance class before. What's it like? It's really fun. First, the dance teacher shows you some new moves like this. Ah. 
Then we practice the new moves, and finally, we get to put the moves together to make a routine like this. Go, go, go. The teacher showed us the move, and then we follow along, like this. Wow! Nice. Yeah. Cool. It doesn't matter what style of dance you do, from ballet to hip hop, you learn the dances the same way. I do well in my ballet class, but I don't know. Ballet seems really different from hip hop dancing. You know, Katie, I've taken every dance class you can imagine. I love learning new styles of dance, like hip hop. <laughs> Some jazz? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Some break dancing? Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Nice. Some tap? Cool. Oh. Yeah. And even some ballet. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, you learned all those dances by taking different classes? I sure did. It must have been a lot of hard work. It was hard work. It took a lot of practice, classes, and dedication to learn those styles of dance really well. You were all such great hip hop dancers. I really wish I was as good as you all. I have an idea. Let's have hip hop dance classes here at the center today. Yeah! <laughs> That's a great idea. But I'm just a beginner. The classes might be too hard for me. I know you can do it, Katie. We'll start with level one so you can learn some basic moves. That's right. And then when you get that down, we'll move on to level two, but more of a challenge. And if you're feeling good after that, we'll move on to level three for an even bigger challenge. Katie, we'll take it one step at a time and see how you feel. That's a great idea. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. If you want to learn, Something new, then you gotta put your mind to it. Do it! Practice hard every day, then you can do it. You can do it! Step one, learn the basic skills. From there, we can start to build. Step two, add something new. Raise the challenge on what you do. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. At times, we might feel it's a bit hard. Take it. Step by step. Far. You can learn by yourself or with a friend. Just practice your skills every day and then do step three, be the best you can be. You'll be successful ultimately, so remember your steps. One, two, three. If you put your mind to it, you will succeed. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. Practice makes perfect. Step by step. How do we learn things? Step by step. So, Katie, what do you say? Are you ready for your first hip hop dance class? Yeah, I'll give it a try. Yeah! Yeah! Come on. Go, 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 go. Before we start our hip hop dance classes, we need to stretch out and get our bodies warmed up. Are you ready? Yeah! <laughs> All right, first, let's reach up high and touch the sky. Reach, reach. Reach! <laughs> All right, now, wave your hands from side to side. Side to side, side to side. Wave your hands from side to side, side to side. Yeah! All right, now, reach down low and touch your toes. Reach down low, 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 touch your toes. All right. Now, we're all stretched out and ready for our first hip hop dance class. Yeah! Are you ready, Katie? I sure am. Yeah! When I say hip hop, you say Harry hip hop. Hip hop, put this on. All right, everyone, let's welcome Katie to her first hip hop dance class. Thanks, everyone. I'm a little nervous. I hope I can do this. <laughs> You're going to be great. Right, everyone? Right. You'll be great, Katie. You can do this, Katie. <laughs> All right. Pinky is going to teach the level one hip hop dance class. Are you ready to go, Pinky? 
You bet. Let's get started. Welcome to Level 1 Hip Hop Dance Class. We're going to do a really cool dance that I call Pinky's Party. Now start with your feet together, and you're going to step to the side and wash your hand. Step to the other side and wash your other hand. Good job, you guys. Take it from the top and feet together. Step to the side and wash your hand. Step to the other side and wash your other hand. Next move, your shoulders are going to come up and then down. And then when you bring your shoulders up, you're going to bring your foot up and then bring them both back down. Good job, you guys. Let's take it from the top. Feet together and wash your hand, wash your hand, shoulders up, shoulders down. Now let's move on. You're going to spin all the way around. Good job, you guys. Take it from the top. Feet together and wash, wash, up, down, spin all the way around. Our last move is you're going to high five your friend. Great job, you guys. Let's take it from the top. Feet together and wash, wash, up, down, spin all the way around. High five your friend. Great. Now we're going to try it two times. Hit it, Hip Hop Harry. And five, six, seven, eight. Wash, wash, up, down, spin all the way around. Level one? I really can learn hip hop dancing. This is great. Great job. Yeah. <laughs> nice work, Katie. Bam. All right. So, are you ready to move on to level two? Sure. Level one hip hop dancing was great. I can't wait to give level two a try. Yeah. yeah. Bam. Go. It's time for level two of our hip hop dance classes. Yeah! Now it'll be a little harder than level one, but I have a feeling you'll get the hang of it, Katie. I'll do my best, hip hop Harry. Are you ready, Riddles? I'm ready. Let's dance. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everyone. I created this dance just for you. It's called the Riddles Rock. Cool. cool. Yeah. Everyone ready? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's do it. So. First move is stomp, twist, stomp, twist. Okay, now you try it, here we go. Stomp, twist, stomp, twist. Good, now let's try it again, we're gonna add more to it. So, stomp, twist, stomp, twist, and slide, pop, slide, pop. Okay, try it again. Five, six, seven, eight, stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. I can't do this move. It's hard. I'll help you, Katie. Watch this. Stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. Don't give up on it. Keep working at it and you'll get it, okay? Just pop your back like this. Okay, try it again. Five, six, seven, eight, stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. I did it! Great work! Yeah. Yeah. yeah! Thanks for the help, Riddles. No problem. All right, let's check it out, you guys. Let's try it all again together. Hit it, Hip Hop Harry! Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. Stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. Great work, yeah. everyone! Yeah. And that's the Riddles Rock. You did it! You finished level two! Yay! I know! I did it! I did it! You were right, Hip Hop Harry. Hip Hop dance classes are a lot like Mad Valley classes, except the moves are different. That's right! Good work, Katie! I knew you could do it! Now, are you ready for level three? Well, I think level two was hard enough. I want to practice the new moves that I learned before I move on to level three. Good idea. Just keep practicing and you'll be ready for level three in no time. Would you like to watch the level three class today? That sounds great. <laughs> cool, come on. When I say hip hop, you say Harry. Hip hop, hip hop, put this on. All right, everyone. We've got a special surprise guest. 
my friend and famous choreographer Shane Sparks is here to teach our next class. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Take it away. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Thank you, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, y'all pretty good hip hop dancers, right? Yeah. OK, look, last night I made up something special for you, OK? It goes a little something like this. Make sure you grab your shirt when you do it. You're going to go slide, punch, punch up, punch down, slip it here, twist the hand, toss the ball, step over, uh, and grab the ball. Y'all get that? Yeah. yeah. OK, let me know. Take it from the top. Take it slow, though. Six, seven, eight. Glide, hit, punch, up, down, hit, Twist, toss, step, and grab. Give it up, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That Yo, was hip -hop great. Harry, can we get some music, please? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Yo, five, six, seven, take it. One, two, three, and four. Five, and toss, seven, ho. Good job. This time you do it, do it two times. Five, six, seven, eight, take it. One, two, three, and four. Five, and six, seven, ho. Slide, hit. Punch and drop, hit and toss, step, ho, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. You guys did awesome. Today, y'all look like tomorrow's hip hop stars. I must give it up for y'all. All right, everyone, gather round. Let's check out the new dances you learned today. Shakes, then my body moves. Hip hop, ballet, jazz, and tap. It's all great. Play it. I'll dance to that. I love to dance. I love to groove. When the rhythm shakes, then my body moves. Hip hop, ballet, jazz, and tap. It's all great. Play it. I'll dance to that. Shakes, then my body moves. Hip hop, ballet, jazz, and tap. It's all great. Play. I'll dance to that. I love to dance. I love to groove. When the rhythm shakes, then my body moves. Hip hop, ballet, jazz, and tap. It's all great. Play. I'll dance to that. 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 Wow. Today was awesome. And I want you all to know that you make me so proud. Do you know why? Yeah. Because I love to learn. That's right. if you just take it step by step. Let's take a look. I can't do this move. It's hard. I'll help you, Katie. 
Watch this. Stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. Don't give up on it. Keep working at it and you'll get it, okay? Just pop your back like this. Okay, try it again. Five, six, seven, eight, stomp, twist, stomp, twist, slide, pop, slide, pop. I did it! Great work! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Practice makes perfect. Yeah. classes were a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah! I like moving through the different levels, from one to two, and someday I'll take on the level three class. Awesome! You can do it! What else did you learn? I can't wait to take more dance classes. Riddle showed me that there are a lot of dance styles to try. Let's check it out! You know, Katie, I've taken every dance class you can imagine. I love learning new styles of dance, like hip hop. Little jazz? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Some break dancing? Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Nice. Some tap? Oh. Yeah. And even some ballet. Yeah. That was a lot of fun. Rills is an amazing dancer. He yeah. is awesome. <laughs> Jake, what did you learn today? I learned some cool new dance moves from our special guest teacher, Shane Sparks. Cool, let's see. Five, six, seven, eight. Take it one, two, three, and four. Five and six, seven, ho, slide. Hit, punch and drop, hit and toss, step, ho, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Whoa, awesome. This move was fun. Yeah. <laughs> well, we surely learned a lot of dance moves today. Speaking of dancing, what's my favorite exercise? Dancing! That's right! It's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! When I say dance, you say circle. Dance! Circle! Dance! Circle! All right, but before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up! That's right, and I have a warm up dance for us to do. All right, okay. I want to teach y'all a warm-up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go. Jump to the left. Jump to the right. Throw your hands up. Now put them at your side. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Do the Harry. Somebody scream. Yeah. Now that we've warmed up, it's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! That's right! Let's do it! Go, 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 Who's next? Go, 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 Who's next? Rodney and Berkey tell the worst joke at school today? Yeah. yeah! Hi, kids. Hi, Hip Hop Perry. It was my last day at school today. Mine too. Summer's here. The school year went by too fast. I had so much fun this year. I'm really going to miss my teacher, Mrs. Smith. But I'm going to visit my cousins. They're going to teach me how to use a computer. And the best part is, is they have a swimming pool. But it won't be the same without you guys there. I know what you mean. I'm going to dance camp this summer. I can't wait to learn some new dance moves. But I'm gonna miss not being here, too. I'm going to basketball camp this summer. I know I'm gonna be so much better when I get back. But I wish you guys were coming, too. I'm going to sleepaway camp this summer. 
We get to go in the woods and swim in a big lake. It's just too bad we're not going together. Hey, Hi, Kiana. Kiana. Hey, guys. I want you guys to do something for me. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Could you guys get together so I can take a picture? Cool. Sure. No problem. Yeah. Cheese. Cheese. Kiana, why are you taking pictures? Well, I'm going to visit my grandmother this summer. I can't wait to see her. But I'm going to miss you guys and all the fun we have here at Hip Hop Central. So I wanted to take some pictures with me. I have a way to make being away from each other a little easier. Really? Yeah. You can use your great memories of all the fun times you've had here. Memories are a great way of keeping your friends near wherever you go. Your friends are always with you, no matter where you might be. Just think about your most favorite times and enjoy all the memories. Your friends are always with you, no matter where you might be. Just think about your most favorite times and enjoy all the memories. Close your eyes and try to remember all the good times, January to December. You use your memory every day to think about all the fun you had last you played. When we think of memories, the good times are endless. Memories start when we use our senses. So don't be sad. School is out. Just use your memory. Let me hear you shout. Your friends are always with you, no matter where you might be. Just think about your most favorite times and enjoy all the memories. Your friends are always with you, no matter where you might be. Just think about your most favorite times and enjoy all the memories. I remember. When I win, you win. And when we're on separate teams, we can still be friends. Remember. To do your part. It shows you care that you have a heart. Remember! Teamwork, teamwork, do the crazy shake and just go berserk. Remember! All the fun adventures that everyone had at the Hip Hop Center. Your friends are always with you, no matter where you might be. Just think about your most favorite times and enjoy all the you all have some great memories to share. I have a great memory to share. Let me tell you all about it, and then here's some of yours. That sounds great. Yeah. I have one too. My favorite memory at Hip Hop Central was when Hip Hop Perry surprised me with the basketball hoop so I could practice my shots. Hey, 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 Scott. How was your first basketball team practice today? Not good. I don't think I want to play basketball anymore, Hip Hop Perry. What? I thought it was your favorite sport. It was my favorite sport. I didn't play well at practice today. I didn't make any shots. But Scott, all the great basketball players spent a lot of time practicing before they became great. You think so? I know it. You should never give up. Anything worthwhile takes practice. Practice makes perfect. Hip Hop Perry, I was going to stop. I felt bad because I wasn't making shots. You said, don't quit. I thought, why bother? Then I realized to try much harder. That's what I did. Now I'm making baskets. It just took practice. That's fantastic. Now I know just what it takes. That's to never give up. Now I'm feeling great. If you're not feeling at your best today, never give up. Never give up. Whether it's a sport or a game you play, never give up. Never give up. Yes, I did it! Haha, <laughs> why is that your favorite memory, Scott? Because that was when I learned to never give up playing basketball. That's why I'm going to basketball camp this summer. That is so cool. I know you're going to be great. You know what else was fun, Scott? The pajama party you missed. We had fun snacks. And Wildlife Wendy came and brought some nocturnal animals. What are nocturnal animals? They're animals that are active at night while we're sleeping. That's neat. Yeah, the owl she brought was so cool. Oh, wow. Great. That's awesome. But how does Woody the owl see at night when it's dark outside? 
That's a great question, Kiana. It sure is. You see, owls have special eyes that are really big. This makes it possible for them to see in the dark. Did you bring any other nocturnal animals with you, Wildlife Wendy? Oh, I sure did. His name is Charlie, and he's a beautiful chinchilla. Oh, Can you guys say chinchilla? Chinchilla! <laughs> he loves being up at night. What does Charlie do at night? He likes hanging out with his friends and running on his little exercise wheel. While everyone else is fast asleep, nocturnal animals look for things to eat. What else do you think they do at night? Do they exercise? Yes, you guessed right. So when the night takes over the day, nocturnal animals come out to play. Some animals play all night long. They're fully active when the daylight's gone. Some animals play all night long. Some animals play all night. All night. That was the best party ever. Yeah, I had a great time at that party too, JJ. Wildlife Wendy is so much fun. I remember when she brought all her birds with her. All right, well, Casper's favorite thing to do is play basketball. Come on, why don't we show him? That's two Whoa. points. Wow. That was amazing. It's time to meet Wazoo. She always has something to say. Here, let me show you what I mean. Hey, Wazoo, why don't we start off with, can you whistle in a neighborly way? <laughs> and now I think, well, why don't you say your name? Wazoo. <laughs> hey, Wazoo, the telephone's ringing. <laughs> <laughs> now there's someone at the door. Very nice. <laughs> Can you call the doggy? <laughs> <laughs> well, now you're scoring big on a video game. <laughs> oh, that was me. Who knew some birds could talk? Yeah. <laughs> hey! I have the perfect thing to enjoy our memories with. What is it, Hip Hop Harry? <laughs> it's a surprise. Come on over to the kitchen. Come on. Let's see. Go, 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 go,
carnival, it reminds me of how close I felt to her that day. I can't wait to visit my grandmother and hear fun family stories that I can share with all of you when I get back. All yeah. right! Hey, Pop Harry, these memories are great, but the popcorn made me a little thirsty. Me too. We should get some water to go with our popcorn. Scott, that's a great idea. Let's get some water. <laughs> there you go, pass those cups out. Go, 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 go. Hey kids, don't forget, when you're playing outside this summer, you need to drink plenty of water to keep yourself feeling good. Yeah! Go, go, water! Go, go, water! Go, go, water! Go, 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 go water! <laughs> hey, JJ, remember the dance contest? Yeah? Boy, did we need water then. Great! Pinky and Riddles are gonna be the judges of the dance contest. And remember, everyone here is a winner! Do your best, have fun, and let's see some cool moves! to announce the winners of the dance contest. Both Orange and Green Team were so great today. It was really hard to choose just one winner. Green Team? You are the winners! Yeah! JJ, your team was really great. Thanks, your team was good too. You need to show me some of those moves. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll show you some of them before we go home. Cool! I'm glad to see that you're still rooting for each other. You know it. Best, Best friends for life! When I say hip-hop, you say Harry hip-hop. Hip-hop, hip-hop, hip -hop. Hip -hop. Hip -hop Harry, what's your favorite memory in Hip-Hop Central? Wow, I have so many. Hmm. Oh, I have one. Follow me. It was Pinky's surprise birthday party, and I was hiding, what? Right here! <laughs> Pinky's coming, hurry up everybody, hide, hide, Pinky's coming! Whoa! Uh, Over here, Bob Harry! He's coming, Pinky's coming! Down, 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 down! Hide, hide, hide. Surprise! Happy birthday! Let's <laughs> oh, this place! Everyone pitched in and did their part. That's right. Hip hop, happy birthday! Hip hop, happy birthday! Hip hop, happy birthday to you! To who? To you! Yeah! Hip hop, happy birthday! Hip hop, happy birthday! Hip hop, happy birthday to you! To who? To you! I loved that party because everyone did their part to help make it the best party Pinky has ever had. I'm going to get my brothers and sisters to help me throw a surprise party for my mom's birthday. Yeah, that'll make it a party she'll never forget. What a great day of memories. Over the summer, I'm going to miss you all, but it's good to have these memories until I see you in the fall. And I know you all are going to have a great time this summer. We sure will now that we learned how to take our memories with us. That's one of the things I love about you guys. You... Love to learn! <laughs> That's right! I love to learn! Things that you can learn in the library. 
Yes, Kendra. I'm really going to miss you, Hip Hop Harry, but I'm glad that I have all of my memories to take with me. You know, I never realized that other people's memories can teach us things. That's great, Kendra. What's one lesson you're going to take with you this summer? I'm going to take Scott and JJ's memory of the dance contest when I go to camp this summer. When we have contests at camp, I'm going to make sure that I cheer for my friends, even if they're on another team. That's great, Kendra. JJ. I'm taking Scott's memory of never giving up in basketball with me, because I know there's going to be a lot of new things for me to try at camp this summer. And even if I don't get something right my first try, I'm going to keep trying till I get it. Now that attitude is going to make every day great. Ha <laughs> ha. Scott. Hip Hop Harry, I'm going to make sure to tell all the new friends I make at basketball camp that they can be anything they want to be too. All right. Elizabeth. I'm taking Kendra's memory of sharing stories with her grandmother with me. I know my cousins and aunt and uncle will have lots of family stories to share. That is going to be great. By the end of the summer with them, you'll have lots of family stories to share with your mom and dad. You're right, Hip Hop Harry. Kiana. I'm taking my memory of today with me. That way, none of you will be far away. And when I share this day with my grandmother, she'll feel like she's right here with me at Hip Hop Central. That makes me really happy. I know she's going to love all your stories. Be sure to bring back some stories to share with us. I will. <laughs> All right, everyone. Let's make a new memory to take with us this summer. What? what? Hey, Pop Perry. Let's all do a little of my favorite exercise. And what's my favorite exercise? Dancing! That's right. It's time for the... Hip Hop Perry Dance Circle! When I say dance, you say circle. Dance. Circle! Dance. Circle! <laughs> all right, but before we get started, it's important that we do what? Warm up! That's right, and I have a warm up dance for us to do. All right, okay, I want to teach y'all a warm up dance. I created it myself. It's called Do the Harry. Let's go! Jump to the left, jump to the right. Throw your hands up, now put them at your side. Do the Harry! Yeah, all right. Now that we've warmed up, it's time for the... Hip Hop Harry Dance Circle! That's right. Let's do it. Be sure to subscribe. When I say good, you say bye.